Um, all right, now here at six, one of the top 10 e-sports labs in the nation is right here in Connecticut, and it's tucked away in plain sight at Griswold High School. Yes, and as Channel 3 New London Bureau Chief Kevin Hogan discovered, the lab does double duty supporting high-tech classes. Your drop area. People should be around us soon, and then we go. Meet graduating senior Trevor Caldwell. He's one of the Wolverines' key players when it comes to competing in esports gaming, an extracurricular activity. These are just incredible machines that you, you can't find anywhere, genuinely. Yeah. With the way that chips are currently, you can't find them like this. The idea was planted years ago at Griswold High to capture the minds of talented and competitive high school gamers who could one day play right into careers in coding. IT, graphic arts, etc. There's no playbook for this. This is something new and different. Coach Rand says the esports team focuses on the game rather than the opponent, hoping to improve a student's competitive skills over the long run. Meanwhile, school superintendent Sean McKenna says the lab will soon be integrated into standard academic classes. It's about a collective effort to engage in some innovative practices that are happening in our classrooms with game-based study and gamification as well as after-school programs with the e-sports programs. Call of Duty is a favorite game for this squad and Trevor. As one player you can't do much on your own. It requires communication, teamwork, and to make sure you have a plan once you see one. Already in a league of their own, Griswold Wolverines eSports Lab is among the top 10 in the nation. As far as uh, just in Connecticut alone, really, um, there are some, but not to the level that we have. All this type of technology will continue to grow. If you want to learn more, we have a link. Just go to the Channel 3 app. With Mobile Newsroom in Griswold, Kevin Hogan, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.